The most important thing in Kazakhstan was the nuclear weapons, for example. Uh, soon after the independence, Kazakhstan became a nuclear weapon state overnight, and it had about you know 1,400 plus nuclear warheads uh, located in different you know uh, sites of the uh, of Kazakhstan. So in 1991, it closed its nuclear test site, and by 1996, it removed all its nuclear warheads. So becoming the first state in history to complete voluntarily uh, nuclear disarmament. So Kazakhstan initially had about 1400 Soviet strategic and tactical nuclear weapons and one of the Soviet Union's two major nuclear sites, uh, you know, they were located in uh, semi Platinsk, uh, where at least 460 nuclear tests were, you know, took place. This was the site and uh, in this uh, area, 460 nuclear tests took place um of russia so uh, ultimately kazakhstan took a very bold step and they dismembered themselves um you know they disarmed themselves with the nuclear weapons in 94 kazakhstan transferred more than a half ton of weapon grade uranium to the us it was a great step in 1995 kazakhstan removed its last nuclear warhead and sealed 181 nuclear test tunnels in may 2000 the united states provided 240 million in assistance to Kazakhstan's denuclearization efforts through non luger Cooperative Threat Reduction Program, which you know started after the uh, disintegration of Soviet Union, to just to control the you know uh, nuclear warheads, nuclear material um, in the ex-Soviet states. So this was a great step by Kazakhstan. And um, why Kazakhstan did not keep these nuclear warheads? Uh, in simple words, Kazakhstan uh, had no uh, concern, new security concerns in the region and beyond. So that's why there was no need to have nuclear weapons and spend a lot of money on their safety and security issues. So this was a, another major, major important thing which Kazakhstan did. Um, another important thing uh, in the Kazakhstan's nuclear weapon related policy are that the Kazakhstan is a signatory to you know, uh, non-proliferation treaty. It has ratified partial test uh, nuclear test ban treaty, BTBT. It has also signed uh, CTBT. Uh, it is part of START 1 and then ratified the Lisbon Protocol to START 1 just to reduce their nuclear warheads and ratified the Central Asian nuclear weapon free zone just to believe they believe that there must there should not be any nuclear weapon in this region, which is Central Asia. So Kazakhstan voluntarily, um, you know, just gave away its nuclear warheads. It has also signed the treaty on the prohibition of uh, nuclear weapons. Kazakhstan is the only Soviet successor state to have signed TPNW. Kazakhstan is a party to collective security uh, treaty organization, which works for the collective security of the you know this region, which is called Central Asia and Eastern Europe. Kazakhstan permits the testing of Russian ICBMs and ballistic missile defense technology at uh, you know Kapustian. Uh, your uh, testing range one quarter of that range is located in Kazakhstan. So it has got a you know um, a Bilateral arrangement with the Russians so they can carry out tests in uh, on their part Kazakhstan is the only former Soviet Central Asian uh, nation to ratify the convention on nuclear, uh, you know safety so basically Kazakhstan's uh, role as a, uh, as a as a say, you know very responsible nuclear weapon state is very good and uh, They abandoned their nuclear program uh, especially nuclear weapons program, but they are now concerned, you know uh, Pursuing their civil nuclear program just for say, you know energy and Russia 